Last week, the Conservative Party posted this. It's true, all politicians lie, just not as much as the Conservatives do. Last week, a rumor about Prime Minister Justin Trudeau made the rounds on social media. It claimed he had an affair with the mother of a student at a school he taught at, West Point Gray Academy, which you now know as West Point Brownface Academy. <laughs> Rumors suggested the Globe and Mail was going to break the story in their paper. But no Globe and Mail story ever came. That's because there was no scandal. It was even debunked by fact-checking site Snopes.com. They called it wholly unsubstantiated. But that didn't stop the Conservative Party from issuing a press release about the scandal asking, why did Justin Trudeau leave his teaching job at West Point Gray Academy? So why would the Conservatives push an unfounded sex scandal about the Prime Minister? The reason we all gossip, to get Facebook likes. <laughs> they knew this would get shared, so they wanted you to do their dirty work for them. This isn't the first time Shears conservatives have been caught lying online. They tweeted that Trudeau was moving a pedophile child killer from the UK to Canada, but a spokesperson for the UK's Ministry of Justice said that story was complete nonsense. And just last week, the conservatives took out this Facebook ad claiming that Trudeau was going to legalize hard drugs, which is also a lie. Or you may have seen this one that says that the liberals are going to tax your home by 50%. It uses this document for proof, but it turns out that they altered the document. Andrew Scheer lies more on the internet than most Nigerian princes. <laughs> Look, if you're gonna spread lies about Trudeau, Andrew, why not at least make them the fun ones, like that he is secretly the son of Fidel Castro, or that he wears fake eyebrows? And Andrew, if you want to spread damaging information about Justin Trudeau, you don't have to make it up. There's so much out there that I had to give it to you pill side effect warning style. <laughs> spreading the kind of fake news that Donald Trump would spread. Now, I know that Andrew Scheer is an American citizen, but we couldn't have Trump-style politics in Canada, could we? Scheer was asked if two Republicans who worked on Donald Trump's campaign are now working on his. Are they working on your campaign, yes or no? Yeah. Well, as I said, we have hundreds of volunteers from all across the country who have a wide variety of experiences at different levels. Seems you can take the boy out of America, but you can't take the America out of the boy. <laughs> hey, Andrew, do me a favor. Leave the fake news to us.